Guys, this is Mr. Joshy J, and this is your preview to the UEFA Europa League final. Manchester United versus Villarreal. We will finally see if Ole Gunnar Solskjaer can lift a trophy as a manager for the first time ever. He's won trophies as a player, but yet to do it as a manager. I really, really hope he's about to make history, Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. I really do, because... Winning the Europa League, what a massive confidence booster that will be going into next season. It gives that Manchester United huge momentum, it really will. So we need to go strong, strong, strong. Strongest lineup as possible. David De Gea has to play in goal. He was absolutely phenomenal against AS Roma. If it wasn't for him, AS Roma could have ended up turning that around because we were so shit at defending. So, in goal, I'll play David De Gea. Right back, Anwan Basaka. Centre backs, Axel Tushabi. Victor Lindelof. Left back, Luke Shaw. Central defence midfield, Scott McTominay. Then in the midfield, Fred Pogba. Bruno Fernandes, Mason Greenwood, and Edison Cavani. Yes, that's the lineup I would go with now. Unai Emery has got a sensational record in this competition. He won it three times in a row with Sofia, I believe. He got Arsenal to the final, but lost. But, you know, massive game. This is our biggest match of the season, without question. Some people may call the Europa League O's the Mickey Mouse Cup, but to me, it's still an important trophy, you know. As I said, if we can win this, what a massive confidence booster this would be for the whole Manchester United team. And for Ole Gunnar Solskjaer to sign his new contracts as a trophy winner. And of course, if we win the Europa League, we'll be playing Man City or Chelsea in the Super Cup and final and also, if you win the Super Cup, I think it's just the Champions League winner. So, or it could be the same as the Europa League. If you win the Europa League in the Super Cup, maybe you go into the World Club in Championships. Or is that just the Champions League winners? I'm not too sure. But anyway, I am absolutely pumped in this final. I've bought two bottles of beer, two big bottles a Heineken and Peroni I'm going to be drinking during the final tomorrow night. Cannot wait. Absolutely buzzing. Now, Harry Maguire is travelled with the squads, but to be honest, I don't think he'll feature. Well, he's fit. You never know. He may come on as a sub, but cannot see him starting the game. No chance. So I'll go with Axel to Shaby. Eric Bailey. I like Eric Bailey, but... With him being injury prone, it's more safer we play Lindelof, I believe, in centre-back position in the final. Cavani has to start. That goal he scored last week against Quilla, my goodness sake, just out of this world. Anthony Agallo scored a brilliant goal. I mean, who knows, maybe we would have him on the bench course. No Anthony Marshall still. He's injured, but to me, Marshall's had an absolute horseshit season. So, yep. Now, this is the final preview I'm doing of this season. And it yet again, for a second season running, it's been a pleasure to bring you every single match preview to the games this season. League Cup, Premier League, FA Cup. And thanks so much for being on the journey with me this season. I can't wait to bring you previews next season. Previews I only started doing last season and as soon as I started I previewed every game. I made it a regular feature on my channel and I still think probably the reviews and the rants are more popular than my previews. But to be fair loads of Manchester United supporters do previews like Mark Goldbridge, She Dangles United and obviously they're much bigger channels than what I am but 
The support you still give me on this previews is absolutely sensational. And I can't thank you enough. Score prediction from this one. I'm going with a 2-1 victory to Manchester United. Come on! Bring that trophy home. Let's give Ole Gunnar Solskjaer his first win as a manager left in a trophy. Well, he's won plenty of times as a manager, but never won a trophy. I really hope that is about to change after 90 minutes. I really do. Of course, could go to extra time and penalties, but I'm hoping and praying it doesn't. Because if it does go to extra time penalties, I'll be shitting my pants. I really will. Wow. You know. Oh, come on. Do it. Please. Please. Just bring that trophy home, United. Let's end this season on a high second place and the Europa League trophy. What a season. That would be an amazing season. Bye-bye. Come on! <laughs> Sorry, headphone users. Bye-bye. <laughs>